Dwayne, Dwayne Pinnell with Transwest Truck Trailer RV. You can find me at D's Luxury RVs or Dwayne's Luxury RVs on Facebook. And I'm at Transwest Truck Trailer RV in Belton, Missouri. My phone number is 816-516-5312. The email, D-W-A-Y-N-E dot P-I-N-N-E-L-L at Transwest.com. Got a treat for you today in a used 2022 Newmar New Air. Now this coach is 35 foot in length and it has 450 horsepower Cummins engine. This sits on a Spartan chassis and it is a 3545 unit. Now it only has about 11,000 miles on it and it's a remarkable price at 34605. We have a $395 dock fee. That's the only additional price that we charge on a coach. So it's $341,000 for this coach. Great price. And we've been through it. We've uh, sent our technicians through here to make sure that we've addressed those things that need to be done. And we have, as you can see, very nice leatherette furniture with the dark suede sable maple cabinetry. So the contrast between the cabinets, the flooring, and the seating surface is very, very elegant and a very, very upscale look, in my opinion. Throughout the coach, we have power blinds. We do have the nighttime shades, the daytime shades. You've got the nice silhouette in the new air. It's considered part of the luxury line. Newmar, several years ago, realized that there's a void in this size coach for elegance. And so they took a lot of those features from their high line units, brought it down to a smaller footprint, so that those folks who no longer want to drive something that's 45 feet long still have the elegance that they require and all the amenities of home. And uh, when they're in their coach, they want to be comfortable. They want to stay in the nice resorts. This coach allows them to do so. We do have heated floors throughout the coach. And you see this one has the table and chairs. With the table and chairs, I will say, that when it is closed, you have just a little bit more space than you would have if you had theater seating with an opposing sofa or something like that. They, the furniture is a little bulky, takes up a lot of that space, or if this was a booth dinette, again, the same thing. So we have a televator TV on this side, and the nice theater seating on this side, all electric under power. The seats in the front will be heated seats, so keep you nice and toasty. You have the cameras around the coach, blinker on the left, blinker on the right. You're gonna see in that camera view going down the road and also a rear camera for backing up and also watching your tow vehicle going down the road if that's something that you do. The table does expand. We have a couple of leaves in the coach so we can drop those in there. If you have four people dining, makes it a comfortable space to do that as well as two folding chairs that are in the coach also. I believe those are in, in the uh, lower storage right now. This is a single bath floor plan, again, at 35 foot. We have a nice china cabinet here with the glass shelves. And believe it or not, people say, oh, china cabinet. Well, you don't have to put glass in there, but it is a nice, elegant feature. Again, one that you carry from home into a coach like this when you're traveling the country. Central vacuum here, nice hydronic heat in the coach and also continuous hot water throughout the coach so those showers are going to be nice and hot you're not going to run out of the the warm water great lighted pantry here again just adjustable shelves full extension on these they have the dovetailed drawers so again a high line feature not just uh, two pieces put together with staples and then over here the solid surface countertop great single basin round sink deep so you can wash and tidy up those dishes after a great meal although this one also has a dishwasher and then the induction removable cooktop now if you've watched my videos you've seen that before so simply you take these off cutting board on this side lift this out plug it in outside keep the smells outside don't have to keep them inside and then you have a a fantastic fan here that's if you do cook inside it's going to draw those smells up and out and also serve as like an attic fan so if you open a couple of windows leave the screens you're going to draw in that fresh air in the coach it's going to go up and give you a nice cross breeze 
throughout the, the vehicle here. Microwave convection oven. Great space in the kitchen. Full extension on that. Just open shelves here. <clears throat> Plenty of space below. And then here you have a trash can. It's always hard to know where to put a trash can. This one you don't have to leave it out on the floor, although it's small. Most of the resorts that you stay at, you would dump your trash anyway and they come by and pick it up. And then again, continuing with those beautiful cabinets inside, the great construction all the way throughout. This is the port where you'd pull the hose for your central vac. And it's got the floor port here if you want to just sweep it over to that area. You've got two air conditioners on this unit, both heat pumps. This does have the silver leaf system here for running the coach, kind of the brains of the coach right here. And then you've got these light controllers throughout. They'll control your blinds, they will control your lights, and um, just a really nice feature. They'll control your shades and the fans. So right here in the middle of the coach, don't have to go too far to adjust that. Your heating and cooling, your AC power, DC power, see the battery health generator that has the automatic gen start on it check your water tank levels and then control your climate you can look at your cameras throughout the coach and anyway just the nice brains of the unit here inside the full bathroom which is the only bathroom in the coach the solid surface countertops are carried throughout the stool with an exit door just behind and a generous size shower for a coach of this size so you don't feel like you're just claustrophobic by being in the shower and in this bathroom because for again a coach this size it's it's pretty nice you also have a nice vanity you saw the lighted mirror there same light controllers in here controls the lights the shades privacy door to shut off the bathroom if you have guests or just want some privacy pull down bench that was in the shower and then nice Samsung refrigerator side by side with a French drawer and there's that dishwasher I mentioned earlier. Moving on back to the master bedroom we have the privacy doors here to close off the master. Beautiful lighting on either side of the bed. And then this has the ports in the corners in case there's somebody that needs a CPAP Instead of putting that unit on the side tables, put that unit above, plug it in there, the masks drop down, and then uh, you can keep the clutter to a minimum here on the side of the bed, maybe a place for your phone to, to charge up overnight. And then the cabinets still continue with a nice large TV. You do have the carpeted bottoms, so the likelihood of things sliding around and shifting while you're driving is less likely than if those were just plywood or board more drawer storage throughout little step up here because the engine compartment is right here so one has to watch their step but there are those chairs you've got the great closet back here it does have a safe um, inside it and then the stacked washer and dryer a splendid overhead cabinets there which I already mentioned for the CPAP but uh, plenty of room this is a great two-person coach I'd say because again you only have really sleeping for two in the master bedroom and uh, that's the way that I would like it um, love people but uh, whenever you retire it's nice to be by yourself and just a great coach now we found this for a little while so the coach is really at a great price. I hope you will um, take my advice. And if you're interested in something like this, give me a call. My name again is Dwayne. These luxury RVs are Dwayne's luxury RVs on Facebook. My phone number 816-516-5312. And my email D-W-A-Y-N-E dot P-I-N-N-E-L-L at transwest.com. Thank you for your brief time today. Give me a call. Have a great day.